What's up guys, here's Claudio from Visual Model WordPress Teams and in today's video we're gonna learn how to disable a section or a content into your Elementor WordPress page builder plugin. Let me explain. Imagine that you really really enjoy this section right here with this person's testimonials but you need to remove this section. However, you just want to hide it, okay? You want to keep this section on your page editor but not visible for your site visitors how to do this into elementor is what you're gonna learn in this video but before i can continue please take a moment to hit the subscribe button like this video and share this content for a friend of yours you have no idea how much it helps us because it bring daily videos about wordpress seo plugins optimizations and many many more topics not just internet on site's favors so let's get this started very first thing to do it's make sure that you have Elementor plugin installed. If not, nothing to worry, okay? Just follow the video tutorials that you're gonna have into our Visual Moto channel on YouTube. As soon as you do this, if you go to any page of your WordPress website from our navigation menu, you're gonna be able to see into the top section of your site a button called Edit with Elementor. We're gonna click on it, okay? This is gonna open up the Elementor page build editor, okay? After this, you're gonna be able to see all of the contents of your page, okay? And you're gonna need to find the section that you would like to hide the element. In my case, it's this section right here, this entire section right here, okay? So I'm gonna click into the section as in order to appear this option right here, edit container or edit, edit section, okay? After this, we're gonna see into the left side bar of menus on the editor, a couple of tabs, layout, style, and advanced, okay? What well, we're gonna change the option for advanced one, okay? Right here, we can customize the set, the sizing, the padding, the margin, the z index, but we're gonna screw it down until we find the option called responsive, okay? Click on it, and now screw it down until you see the visibility options. Right here, you can hide this section into desktop, hide the section into tablet, and hide the section into mobile. If you hide into these three options, these three versions of your page, the section gonna be hidden, so nobody gonna be able to see the section into the side front end. Let me show you. Let me duplicate the tab and go to the home page. As you can see, the section no longer exists for us, but it is still right here, but no longer accessible. Now, if you change it, you can hide it only on desktop, but show on tablet and mobile, okay? It's up to you. Just remember that before doing anything or after doing anything, update your page to save the change, okay? And it is. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Feel free to use the comment section below in the case that you have any question. Don't forget to check out our borderless WordPress plugin to gain widgets, elements, templates, and tools to build up your site using Elementor or Gutenberg or Enzo WordPress team, the best free WordPress team that you can install to customize your site in the way that you want, or growth.net platform, a um, place where you can submit your blog for receiving and publishing guest posts, or sites.gallery, that is a CSS gallery where you can promote your app, your game, your website design, and finally, our visualmoto.com a place where you can go premium while you're doing your WordPress website, in the case that you want to unlock our full library of pre-built websites templates, hundreds of sites that you can import with a single click and start with a ready site from the beginning. In addition for premium icons, blocks, themes, plugins, templates, widgets, and many, many more features to create the site of our dreams. And that is, hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I see you tomorrow. All the best!